Hey, good morning, good morning, guys. It's another beautiful day. And today it actually looks like we're going to get some sunshine. At least there for a little bit we did. And yeah, so I am just getting ready to uh, do some editing. I've been pretty busy here for the last two days, so I haven't really done any editing. So it's time to go ahead and do some editing. All right, guys, we are in Winnipeg right now. We just uh, finished having breakfast here in uh, Perkins here uh, on Highway 1. And the uh, reason for us to come to Winnipeg is pick up our daughter, eh? Yep, that's right. Today is the day when we take her home again. Yeah. We miss her too, so... We'll go ahead and go over there and pick her up and take her home. But uh, <clears throat> I went to uh, go check to see how far they've gotten with my safety there this morning. And yeah, not looking too good. <laughs> they found a uh, cracked rim on my steer. Uh, that's not good. Those are actually almost brand new rims. We only put them on last year. So I can't believe that they already cracked but i guess you get a faulty one every once in a while and this was one of them i guess but uh yeah so they found two wheel seals leaking on the rear axle both sides of the rear axle the wheel seals were leaking found the brake pot was loose and all of that i i don't know there's a lot of stuff that they find and Still waiting on some parts to uh, get that EGR valve system put back in there. They didn't uh, see, I guess when I was over there, they didn't see uh, the few pipes that were, uh, I guess, cut off. Just straight cut off or whatever. And they didn't see that, I guess, last time when I was over there having them look at it. So that way they could order the parts, right? And I guess that's to be expected. They can miss something. And no, they got a rush hour, a rush order that in, and it's supposed to be flown, uh, flying in this afternoon, unless customs won't clear it. But other than that, it should be here this afternoon, and luckily they work till midnight, so should be able to get her done pretty close. Anyways, you're probably tonight, or if not tonight, then probably by tomorrow sometime. And we got a fly in here when we went camping, and uh, still in here. <laughs> You know how that goes, I like to fly right into your face, right? But uh, anyways, let's go over there and pick up our daughter and go home, I guess. I'm back at home again, guys, and I brought my tarp out here. And we're going to get that all dried up and stuff like that. And then uh, what we're going to do is uh, we're going to get start working on this part here. Ripping this off of there. I already lowered this board up here. And I made sure it's screwed on over here so you can see there's a couple of screws in there so it can come off and it's also got a board up here so that way it won't slide down and then we'll get up there and start ripping that all apart there for my friend Barry so it's easier for him to do the work over there and then we're gonna go ahead and roll this tarp out because it was quite wet when we uh, when we cleaned up there from camp so we'll go ahead and roll that out and then that can dry over there so the sun is peeking through every once in a while a little bit so let's go ahead and get to it hey guys i just finished ripping all of that stuff off of there as you can see now all the way till the end although that plywood has been ripped off over there yeah let's take a look yeah look at that eh it's all done ready for my friend barry there to uh to put that other uh, aluminum stuff on there right eh? and what else i did is uh i finished uh putting a second coat of paint on top of this uh roof here or by the roof here right eh? just finished doing that look at that all of that stuff up there and just finished uh putting a second coat of paint on there so that should look really nice now at least we got nice and sunshine over there so that at least should start drying that a little bit so hopefully here 
in a few days they'll be nice and dry that's the goal anyways I still haven't taken the garbage away but yeah gotta leave something for tomorrow right I still haven't put a coat of paint on here either yet uh, still gotta do that yet but we'll probably do that tomorrow it's supposed to be a nice day tomorrow as well so we'll probably get around to doing that tomorrow but guess what else we're doing yeah look at that we're starting a campfire up there and voila guys look at that doesn't that look amazing or what some nice beef ribs guys we're gonna have us a nice beef for a barbecue yeah look at that we got the fire starting I told you guys earlier we're gonna put the tarp out here to let it dry out so still got to fold that up and clean that up yet but uh, hey we'll get to it here in a minute all right guys it is time to check on the meat that's how I look mmm that is starting to look really nice I think here in a little bit I think we're gonna be able to go inside look at that juice coming out there on the top eh? Wow that is nice I think here in a little bit we're gonna go inside and have a good bite to eat. What do you guys think? Are you guys hungry by now? I hope so. Well guys, if you are hungry, you might want to turn this off. <laughs> Look at that guys. We are going to eat some really, really nice meat. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Oh man, that is awesome. Tastes very good. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come. 